polka dot design. What about the polka dot design, man? That should be the checkered one, right? Yeah, and the checkered design. Cool. I like how Mario's still like big. By the way, if you hit two or more design bomb, the pattern always ends up being a star, no matter what. So remember that. Once you're done with the design, I'll decide it perfectly matches the artistic vision of Spark. Okay, cool, dude. Can I just like start this already? I want my freaking bean star. All right, that's all I have to tell you. So get started. Okay, okay. So you gotta just follow what he's like saying here. So he wants a red color, so anything with the red. So basically, you just have to hit the red one like this one. So there you go. Yeah, you just have to wait for them to align, you know, just time yourself like that. If you run out of water, you can just, like, step onto the right and then come back. It's not that far of a walk, though. So anything with the red color, he says, so, you know, just, like, at least hit one. Yeah, see a red polka dot design? It looks ugly, but, oh, whatever. Yes, that's it! That will do fine! Next on the next one. Let's see, the next design he wants is a yellow and a checkered pattern. See, so you can, as you can tell, it gets a little bit, like, harder and harder each time. The hardest one is actually the fourth one. But the reason why I hate this minigame is because of the timing part. I just hate timing. Yeah, I was, like, I just hate timing. Let's, let's make it... Oh, yeah, checkered pattern. I was gonna say, like, I was gonna make it a star. You gotta be careful, though, when you press, uh, when you press B. Because, well, you wanna be sure that it's, well, like, the checkered pattern. So, let's see. There you go. Yeah, see, it's worth the wait. I like that design, though. Looks, looks okay. Looks like a little farmer girl, you know, like, from the 60s. Not even the 60s, like, in the 40s. So he said something purple with a polka dot flare. Now, like, the, the rules of color apply here, so if you do, like, red and blue and red, it becomes purple, blue and yellow becomes green, red and green, red and yellow becomes orange, you know, etc. I mean, actually, it's all the combinations, but if you mix all three of them together, they become brown. So now you gotta wait for the blue one and the red one to line up. It's gonna take a while, though, I'm gonna tell you that much. Oh my god, dude, hurry up! Na -na 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 Oh, right here. Oh, the yellow one's, like, in the way. Okay, wait. As long as the yellow one's not on the way, we're good. Dude, yellow, can you get out of the way? Yeah, this is gonna take a while. Dude, yellow! Okay, wait, wait. I had it. I had the perfect chance. Right there. Oh, we missed! Yeah, see all that waiting for nothing? Uh, I don't care. Oh, we got all three. That's cool. Yeah, look how mad he is. No, this is all wrong! I'm sorry! It's not my fault the blue one's moving so slow. I hate this minigame so much. Oh, there we go. Okay, cool. And a polka dot design. Don't mess this up. Because if you mess this, mess this up, you have to start all over again. And it sucks. I'll tell you that. Let's see. I've got to be careful, though. Um, yeah, pay attention to that polka dot one right there. See, all three of them are in. There we go. Oh, we missed. Okay, it's fine. At least we didn't, like, hit anything. That would mess it up. Dude, how, why is it so slow? Well, actually, it makes sense if it's so slow, so... I just hate waiting like this. There you go. No! Oh my god. Don't be mad. It's your fault for your freaking things to be like that slow. And we didn't want that to happen. Yeah, we're gonna talk to you. Alright, well, this might take a while. I'm planning him not to take a while, though. I just wanted to, like, not be over with. I just want to look good. Look good. There we go. They're here. Alright, so... So we can get the blue and red now, like, together. Just this polka dot one. There we go. Oh, barely, barely, because if it barely, like, missed a checkered one. This one is kind of hard if you don't know how to do it. So what you want to do is, like, hit B right away, like that. So, like, you don't even need to wait for him. Just hit B right away. It'll be eventually become brown altogether, so. And then hit all three. So, yeah, that's a little technique that I, like, figured out. Just, like, press B as, long as soon as, like, you see them. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Go next door and get your pay. I don't care what you guys did. Yeah, no even like thank you. Like of how like I designed your material. No thank you. You suck Mario and Luigi. You suck. See, it's a mean like thing. I promise you. Take it with you now. Oh man, this is, this is intense. How do you even get that? How do you even manage to get that thing locked up? Uh, why would you even lock it up? Say we got Bean Star number two, so two more to go. I'm gonna tell you what. The next two isn't as long as getting the first one. But it isn't as short as getting the second one, so... Only two more to go! Cool, Mario, cool. Yeah, now, what we're going to do, actually, is... Like I told you guys, I wanted some Woo Beans. Let me just show you this. Yeah, I need, um, 15 Woo Beans, right? So I'm gonna get 15 Woo Beans, and etc. But, first and foremost, I'm gonna show you guys where we can get, a uh, Oh, a Chuckle Bean right here. Let's see if we can get an extra Chuckle Bean. That would be amazing if we can get an extra Chuckle Bean. Chuckle Chino. 
Anyways, uh, I was right here. Another one. Oh my god. Well, we want to get that too, Mario. Anyways, if you, can, if you go right, you can get items here. And the reason why I want here is because we get the Who Bean. Again, we need about 35 Who Beans, counting the 10 that we already need. So we can get all the Chuck Chino stuff on Star Bean. Yeah, but anyways, I'll just see you guys at Mushroom Kingdom. And yeah, I'm going to go ahead and fight some guys right here. So I'll just see you guys there. Alright, we are here at Starbucks or Star Beans Cafe, and we're gonna exchange our beans so we can get some free stuff. Free stuff is awesome. Um, we can't do the Hoo Hoo Blind until later, so we'll just do the Hulumbian. So yeah, 15 of these and 10 of those are good. So now we need 23 more Hoo Beans so we can get the Hakuchino or Hulumbian. Not the Hulumbian, what was it called? The Hoo Hoo Blend? Well, the one that I showed you. You got the Hulumbian, which is awesome. Oh god, a cutscene. I love this guy's cutscenes. Can you guys know that there's only two more left? Oh man. Well, here I am in the flesh. It's been quite a while since I was since... Well, wait, you, you, uh, I'm lost for words well, so... Yeah. What are you talking about? Oh hey boss, what's up? Oh, your shadow's looking pretty thin there. <laughs> I like how I was like little... I don't know if you guys noticed how I was blinking a little bit. You haven't been sick, have you? Oh no 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 no, I'm just testing my latest invention. A gown that lets anyone in become a ghost. By wearing this gown, you can become a ghost anytime, any place, anywhere you want. Dude, that's an awesome power up. It's like Boo Mario for Oh, is that a future foreshadow power up? So you finally become a ghost yourself, eh, boss? <laughs> Luigi's afraid of ghosts. <laughs> yep. And while I may be a ghost, I can still taste new drinks. Yeah, that's why he's glowing, is because he's a ghost. Man, this guy's inventions are like amazing. He should like work for the USA man, fix some stuff here, invent some crap that like everyone would buy, but it's completely useless. I don't know. It's just that kind of beat, juice that I'll try to long overlook work in a factor life first. <laughs> we just runs away. Thanks for the sampling. Here's a little something I invented in my spare time. Cool, we got the cobalt necktie. Watch, I'll show you what that does. Oh, Luigi's Mansion! <laughs> That's an awesome homage to Luigi's Mansion. That was a, that's an awesome cutscene. Um, well, I'm gonna go now. Um, let's see. If I don't get the the other one, the Hoo Hoo Blend, I'm not going. I'm just gonna drink all th all six of these. And yeah, what these does is actually they raise their stat boost. So yeah, we'll definitely do that later on though. Um, let's see though. We got the Cobalt Necktie, so we should check that out. What that is. The Cobalt Necktie doubles your stash points. Let me tell you guys what, my stash points are completely like super maxed out. What the stash really does now, once like it's kind of maxed out for buying and selling, is that it'll basically like give you more like chances to get a lucky, which is a critical hit. So anyways, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Um, I already did this in my off screen, but if you head north here and go to the right, like if Luigi goes under the post here, and then go up here, you can activate a warp pipe, which is really, really important too, so I, I recommend doing it. So yeah, this is warp pipe number two, so basically I have everything, we're just missing four, which I know where it is, so I'll go ahead and do that later on though in the game. Anyways, we're gonna head on to get the third bean star. Man, we're moving on this game quite fast, let me tell you that. Alright, now right here is, well, a new enemy, but we're gonna try to skip. Actually, let's just show it off right now. I think we already came across this thing. It's called a Tanumba. Oh, there's the Parabini right there. Yeah, the Paratroopy. Yeah, I think we already came across these guys. Um, when they attack, they rather attack with uh, with, a, with its tail. I'm really not sure if I came across this. So yeah, if it's Louis, they have two attacks. They can like either like have the hammer so you can attack them. If it's Luigi, it'll attack Mario, and then Mario attack Luigi, and then there's a jumping thing that you have to dodge, so that one's self-explanatory, though. It's all about timing. Anyway, slot this big troopy, tro Koopa Troopa at the end. That's not the Koopa Troopa that you have to race in Super Mario 64, man. Oh my god, why'd you do that? And you say the same crap all over again. Ooh, this fancy looks amazing. The theater? Oh, it's a Yoshi theater, that's why. Now of OCD, I just don't like how there's no sign on the right side there. Like, there's no sprite here. But we should talk to him, though. Yeah, what about a potatoes? Hey, what's with you two? I don't know. You can't just waltz up and start talking to my master. You weasels, look at you. There's no doubt in my mind that you come along looking for money. Dude, you're looking for money, okay? Okay? 
Well, okay. Well, I have you know that my master is a very busy guy, so he doesn't have to time waste money on. Well, no waste of time, I guess. But the potato, man, the potato. What? The beans start busting to four pieces. Yeah, that's what you're looking at right now, bud. Oh, master, master, you mustn't listen. You can't listen. All this talk is just meant to swindle you out of your money again. It's all lies. Lies! What the heck? Oh, that's, that's cool, man. Look at that, look at that. Ooh! <laughs> that is awesome. Silence, you twit! I like how I did that. What a Yoshi wannabe. Looks like William Shakespeare, man. And with that, please excuse me. Oh, you're definitely excused, man. <laughs>